Courtney Clutter, and this is hi, I'm Courtney Clutter, and welcome to Kiki's Palace. Um, I am doing my first, uh, what is it called? Uh, I guess vid like a um, video review, and where sh she talks about products. So it's called a review or something that I swear by. I would like to start off with um, first of all, I had um, a bartender from where me and my sister and my mom and all of us like to go hang out uh, at a pretty much kind of club thing. Mm -hmm. That's what it's called. Um, it's a duct tape wallet, and I think it's pretty cool. I, I have one, too. It's a camera. camera. I probably had it with me, though. It's mm -hmm. This part, like right here, is all uh, like a greenish color, and then where my flames are is a camo. It's super cool. It's really, really cool. They're really neat. It's got a little pocket on the back. We actually there. have a, another a friend that we go to college with and we went to school with her in elementary or uh, Molten for a while. Molten, I want to say. Junior high we went to school with this girl and she does duct tape purses and I wanted I wanted her to make me one so bad. Who's that? Heather. Yes. She makes she makes them and out of Kool-Aid. The Kool-Aid jammers pouch. Kool -Aid pouches that and duct so cool. tape. And she's just she's a good fat she's a fashionista. She takes anything and mm -hmm. She's awesome. I like it. The next thing I would like to do is um, with deodorants. My favorite one right now, the one that I'm on, is by Scent Expressions by Secret, and it's a clear gel, and it's called Truth or Tear, and it smells awesome. Um, you want to show that to your people? <laughs> it is like one of the best. I love I the gels I better. I'm so good. It's good, but the the gel it doesn't show up as much on your shirt and th with this the more gel. you move the more it works like it is the best ever and, the and one how much do these retail for I know you get them at Walmart but you want to say about four or five bucks mm. or three maybe three three ninety nine this stuff like is that. about like two to three dollars okay. maybe so it's inexpensive you get it at Walmart yeah. County Market you get, I mean, generally. you get a good quality amount. I guess if it's what you can afford, but it's actually affordable. And this one is another crystal clear gel, secret scent expressions. It's Love Me Some Lily, and it's it's another one that just smells awesome. It you can't really, I guess, see it because the glare, but it's a pink color. And they also have like spray, like body spray mist for these things. And that one, it it stays with you too. Like all these, uh, they smell, they smell. Scent expressions, like it's always Ooh. the more you move, the more it works. Did you smell this one? Mm -mm, that's not it. That was my favorite right now. Ooh, that smells nice. I wish you guys could smell these. This, this takes me back really to good. some part of my childhood. And Mine I can't, too. I can't think, but it just takes me back to a part of my childhood where I remember that scent. Just like my mom had this Christmas scent, and she, it's like a Christmas tree scent, but it took me back to when I was last year. She you know, put some in our oil burner and I was like, something like ginseng and I was like, oh my gosh, but this smells so familiar. It took me back to when I was in third grade around Christmas time. I was sitting up in my um, elementary school up in third grade. We had the hardwood floor and we were sitting around coloring Christmas pictures and having our little kid Christmas party and I just remember that with that scent. It just took me back. I thought it was really cool. The things you do that, and this does it a lot for me. It's Another secret um, scent expressions is Ooh La La Lavender. Oh, I love lavender. And this one's a shorter one, one, so it's going to fit better on the screen here. <laughs> it's one of the, like, the minis. Uh, the other two, they're... Um, Do they have vanilla by any chance? This one's a um, 1.7 ounce, and these, they might have vanilla. This one is 2.7 ounce. Oh, if they had vanilla, ounce. they'd have them sold. <laughs> vanilla, I love vanilla and lavender. They're my two favorite scents. That and that, some stuff called, like, Amber. Oh yeah, amber or something like a woodsy. All, all three of those have me set. If you want to get me a good Christmas gift, there you go. Something with lavender, vanilla, or something with amber, and candles too, guys. I mm -hmm. love candles. Oh my gosh, I think I have to buy this to kind of go shopping. And it, whenever you, like you know, ladies, you shave your underarms. Um, yeah, the it it burns a little bit if you get into where you've cut or whatever, but then. Like, I don't know, like, it makes me heal up like nothing. Like, it is amazing. Yeah, speaking <laughs> of underarms, I w was watching a couple days ago, and you get, you have, like, the 
dark underarm. I'm not gonna lift mine up because I have they're not too dark, but it's embarrassing. So, but um, they say it's caused from shaving and the uh, the sometimes the deodorant stuff, like the perfume, they can have that effect on it. But there was something that they said you could do to kind of lighten up the dark on it. Which next time I'm, they have this stuff, I think it's from Dove. It's called Clinical, yeah. and it's just to take away to make your underarm clearer. And I'm sorry, I don't know about you guys, but I ain't gonna go three. I ain't gonna go with like a damn jungle woman and not shave my underarm. That's just disgusting. I can't. It is. It's I can't stand gross. hair. So I mean, like I said, my underarms—they're not that bad, but they do have like the dark circles, and it's just disgusting. But anyway, that's just a suggestion. A suggestion. This is something about egg, rub an egg. But I'm not gonna waste. Damn, I'm not gonna waste an egg. Eggs are expensive. They're for they're to eat, not to put on your arms. But now I might do it for my hair because that's different. But anyway, it makes it feel. Anyway, good. yeah, back to these. Mm-hmm. We'll do on. We'll go on to lotions now. Um. Oh, uh, one that I would just swear by is Secret Wonderland by Bath and Body Works. Um, it's it's the body cream. I don't know right. who actually. Um, you know, made this, but and it's by Bath and Body Works, like that, like the Bath and Body Works collection. Actually, I mean, like um, the person who actually made it. Oh, but I don't. It's, it's the signature collection. Oh, so I think you. But I have a bottle of it, and it's smaller than that. That's the big. This is the body cream. That's it's, the it's, lotion. That you yeah, have. I have the lotion. This is the body cream, but they both smell the same. They smell f- fantastic. And next so time I'm gonna go buy to. the perfume. I don't have that, but it's. Um, I know people say that either you get the does good or feels good. Well, this is the feels good and it does good. Um, I use it every time I get out of the shower or anything but like that. Personally, I mean, it just depends on your oh, skin yeah. type and what you prefer to use. Here's what it looks like. It, I mean, it's a very, very just cute like bottle. I collect my bottles and lotions, everything. Lotions work differently for people, but I mean. And now, Bath and Body Works. I mean, I have dry skin, and some other products I don't find very helpful. But now that some of these Bath and Body Works products, they last all day, and especially the perfumes, they are really good. I say I wouldn't pay that much, but when I get the money, I do because they have I like tons to of deals. Good. I tons like to smell deals. good. Yeah. Oh yeah, we ran into a lot of deals last time we. we I came. would like to go on to the Forever Sunshine, and this is also the body cream, and it's also a signature collection from Bath and Body Works. You can get the perfume. It it kind of makes me think of the Lifesavers peaches and cream. Mm-hmm. That's what it makes me think of. My uh, fiance got these for me for Christmas, and I'm still oh using them. And I don't own this. That one does the same yeah. as the Secret Wonderland. And I my, don't personally own this, but I do think it's really good. My first and, like, it will always be my favorite scent from Bath & Body Works is the Japanese Cherry Blossom. Oh, this yeah. one is the body lotion. Yeah. I do like the body cream better, mm-hmm. but I'll take what I can get because it smells awesome. It's got vitamin E, java, and shea butter, so it's really good for your shea skin. Shea butter, good when it's wrapped in your shea. Yes. It smells fantastic. I had a big bottle of this, but I just could never use it, so I gave it to her. Because my lotion, bottle was used, use and it. it like it was in a thing like that. It was the body cream. It was gone maybe within, I want to say, a few months. And normally, you know, as you can see, I've let that last, and it's almost been a year since I've had that. And I just, I bought a, a thing of the body wash for that my freshman year of high school, and we're in college now, and, um, I've had that since my freshman year, and just, I'm going to say about last year, I just stopped, uh, like, I just got to using it all because I just used a little amount, and a little dime size. It's a foamy, but it makes your skin feel like A little dime size amount lasts forever. I mean. So get out there, and the the Bath and Body Works um, pump, uh, pump foaming wash. Yeah, for your body, get it, no matter what it is, because. It will make yeah, your skin I mean, feel like silk. It feels so good. You're, you're gu- yeah, I mean, you're guaranteed it, no matter how much you pay, no matter what it is, it's you're guaranteed it's going to smell good because they don't have a scent that smells nasty. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm not really fond of lotions and stuff, but when I see something, but when I walk in there, 
I pretty much have to smell everything because I just smell so damn good there. And I'll spray everything. I have yeah. to smell good. Like, I don't I feel like I smell bad. And I'll tell you, my I'm day worst, is not right. I'm the worst critic when it comes to perfumes and stuff. I have not smelled one product in there that smelled horrible. It all smells good to me. So. Okay, now I want to go on to after I get out of the shower, I you know I've shaved my legs and like this. I use the Forever Sunshine for, you know, my body, and I use the Secret Wonderland for feminine areas, and then I'll use the Mary Kay Timewise Visibly Fit Lip Body Lotion. Um, I'm not sure how much it is, but I'm guessing you can still get it from Mary Kay. Use it on your legs, and it'll make your legs feel soft all day. It'll make them not chalky. It'll make them like really just glowing and it's hard to explain what you know it'll look like and it with me it's very hard to find lotions that'll like my my skin isn't really dry it's I don't know it's immune to lotion I guess so it's hard to find lotion that'll fit my skin's needs and now Mary Kay their products are pretty much expensive but we just had that given to us so. yeah so if you can get your hands on any Mary Kay stuff I would definitely do it because that I really works really I well. really don't like the foundation, though. The foundation kind of, there for a while I used it, and it's like, okay, I guess it's not in the right shade, but there, like it made my face feel r really cool and made it look really good, but then again, it kind of looked like it was fake, or like the face was fake. Or, or like you were like in the, in, like, in the morgue. Like it in just looks cakey <laughs> and stuff and just looks really bad, and I don't like it. Okay, the next thing I would like to go on to is, um, since we're already sort of, still on the topic of body, Bath and Body Works. I have four perfumes here. Yeah, four perfumes. And I just want to let everybody know that the ones that I'm going to be showing you, oh, five, sorry. The ones that I'm going to be showing you, they're not even close to how many perfumes I have. No. And in a little bit, I will Show take you. the computer, um, the camera to my closet and, and I will show collection. you my whole collection. Okay, so. This is, I like this. I think I, I like the bottle better than the scent. Um, it's the Be Enchanted. I just love the bottle. I'm in love what with does it. What smell like? It sort of smells like candy or something. Mm -hmm. It's kind of what it makes me think of. Oh, it smells like a, oh, I, don't, I can't remember. It smells good, but I'll have to spray it I can't remember who I, who, who does, who creates it. the scent. I can't remember who creates the scent, but it smells like that cotton candy flavor that you get from a, I think it's called like the body collection, and you get from Walmart and stuff. But only you know, this one smells a lot better. You know, it's for little girls and stuff. And the next one, that kind of stuff for, that's just all I, think. I would like to go on to. Or it's called like the fantasy it's collection. It's Twilight Woods. This bottle isn't too fancy. I think I have some of that in my house, but it smells, I love that stuff. It smells good. Um, just, and it, as you can see, it's like almost gone. It's got me here. Um. And it smells, it almost has, like, you remember how I told you about the amber scent? That's what that smells That's like. That's what this smells like to me. It smells really good. Um, I have the lotion for that. And yeah, um, I have two big bottles. Actually, I'll show you right here. Um, Twilight Woods. <laughs> I have two of these, by the way. I got, one of them was a Christmas present from my fiance, and the other one was a Christmas present from my sister. So, um, yes. <laughs> Um, the next one I would like to show you. Huh? I said your socks smell bad. Oh yeah. Um, the Japanese cherry blossom. I have one of these, and I have two of the little bottles, but they're red. And one of them, they're in my purse somewhere. I just cannot find them right now, unless they're in the closet, and I just haven't seen them. And they've every time I go, they've always reshaped the bottles mm -hmm. of this and the lotion. They're always different. They're never the same. Nope. And then this next one, it's a prettier bottle, <laughs> and there's not much of this left like either. Or Into the wild, and the actual perfumes of all of these, they smell so much better. I mean, these smell good too, but they they smell way better. And I, the ones that I like are the perfumes that smell the most expensive, mm -hmm. but are the cheapest. When you normally find Ooh, expensive perfumes. Good. They don't smell good. They don't really smell good half the time, and I don't understand why the that is. The inexpensive ones smell bad. Um, okay, now, I know a lot of people are probably going to be against this, but Dollar Tree 
has one of the best <laughs> lines of perfume. No, I am trying. I'm not the. I mean, it's real perfume, but I mean, I'm not the real brand. It's just an impression of, but it. Oh, it smells good. I have a few here. I have Forever by Mariah Carey, and this is what the box will look like. It looks like a little chair. And this is what the bottle will look like. It's purple fluid. And these are inexpensive. They're only a buck. A dollar. So dollar Tree. They're a buck. So a dollar and plus tax. But I mean, the next one. You're going to try something new to get these because you can't go wrong. It's Halle Berry. I have a couple of It looks like an ocean at the very top. Um, and this one is like a meh, amber looking liquid. It smells exactly like it smells similar. I don't have any of that, but I'm going to try it. I'm gonna go back and buy it. The next one is Paris Hilton. Looks like a big old disco ball. And the Britney Spears and this uh, Paris Hilton kind of looks the same, I guess. Um, here's this is the pink. And you'll find a bunch more of these in my closet. I have Hello Kitty. I have a Treasure Pink. Um, I have tons of them. Um, oh, I forgot that that one. Oh. Bath and Body Works. Here's some more. The Shimmer Mist. Every time I get out of the shower, I spray this and the cherry, Japanese cherry blossom in my hair because it makes your hair smell very good all day. Not right against your hair, just a length away. I spray it through out I all have, my hair. Um, I have a lotion to this and I haven't even used it yet because I'm just working it on smells so good. It smells good. I use it for whenever I need a quick, something quick before I go. Oh. Um, I am obsessed with the Lucky You brand, the Body Mist. Um, I like the perfume too, but right now the only thing I can get right now is the perf just the Body, body mist. mist. It smells fantastic. I'm obsessed with it. If they never had Lucky, I probably wouldn't know what to do, or if they just stopped selling it. I think it. this one right here is about from this about I want to say seven dollars. Yeah, it's seven fifty now. It's kind of it's kind of pricey, I think. But I it mean, is, but. I mean, for me, but it's it for smells last good. Well. It smells good. I mean, if you make it last a while, but um, well, I, I just don't really see that spending that much. But now Bath and Body Works, that's what. Oh, uh, and then here's um, Dollar General. You can pretty much get this. Actually, it's called Spin, and it's an impression of Twirl by Kate Spade. Um, there is a. You can get this at Kato. I'm pretty sure. This is what the box and the perfume Did you get the, like. you got that at a Dollar General? Yes, I got this at Dollar General for, it sold for only $2, but the machine messed up and I got two boxes for oh, a penny a piece. Okay. Um, and another good place to find a uh, great smelling scents is Avon. Avon. The only, yeah, the only time I actually you. get them is if I know how something smells already and then I'll buy it because I have enough money or if they have a little scratchy, you know, scratch and sniff, then I will get it. But if they don't, I can't because it, I don't want to risk in having something smell horrible. But this is uh, Amari Seduction. Yeah. And uh, Carrie Hilson. Carrie um, Hilson is the one who advertises it. She's a spokesman, it. spokesman woman for this. She uh, talks about it all the time. It's in a pretty bottle. And I didn't really like this, how this smelled, but this purple... It smells way better than the just Amari. It smells, it's got a better smell than what it did years ago. Okay. Um, okay, and then um, lastly, Since for we my have stuff thing here, Kato. I got great things from Kato. I have had um, a few of these for just actually a year now. Actually, just about a year. In September, it'll be a year, and I'm still, I have a bunch. I love Tattooed. I am a big Ed Hardy fan. Um, my favorite one is the Paradise Girl, and it's got the butterflies. I like it because it's butterflies. And I collect the bottles. I have the um, one with the fish on it. I can't remember what it's called, but it's sitting over there. It's like a big, you know how the, how you see it. The Pisces sign is what it looks the, like. With the Pisces sign. My ex-boyfriend, he had one of those. But um, what's the point? Um, we all, you know, you see them. The people, there's a lot of people that have those, and that's what was on this bottle. I mean, the fish, Pisces sign is big. Maybe I'm a Pisces, we're Pisces, so maybe we should get them. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. <laughs> well, another one is NY Fashions. It's the impression of J. 
Je Sarah Jessica Parker. It smells really good, and it's really cute. It's got different, like, it's got cheetah print, leopard print, um, camouflage. It's just different designs all in one bottle. It smells really good. And Kato's perfumes are only $4. That's it. But they smell great. They smell like the real deal. Like, it's, it's just awesome. I also have Amazing, and it's the impression of uh, Victoria's Secret. I would show you the box. It's pretty pink, and it looks just like the oh, bottle. I was just but saying, I, I got rid of the box. The, when this bottle is reminding me of that expensive brand you get from the Bourbonners or um, that's a great place to something else. Yeah, you wanted to talk about expensive perfume, but it just kind of reminds me of the uh, that stuff called Aqua Du Jour or mm -hmm. something like that, or Agua Du Jour or something like that. It's Aqua Du Jour. <laughs> Aqua Du Jour. Yeah, that's what the bottle kind of reminds me of. And that, and then there's something else, another scent that it reminds me of. I just don't plug my computer in either, let us know. I'm going to take you to show you some of the ones over here that I have. Here is the other tattooed, and it's just, uh, it's, I guess it's just called women or something. That one has a, uh, a heart on it. And I do like this one. A heart. Um, uh. This other one, Ko is the or you do have a koi. Of, it's got the Another fish on it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I thought so. Um, I never actually. Then used. my fiance used the, uh, oh. which it's almost not even gone. But um, this one is called, I guess, for men. It's just for men. It's mm -hmm. got a dragon on it. It's blue. See, I'm not. I've never really used Ed Hardy, so I'm not really like a really. So. A big. I was the same big fan. I've never really used it. And I, I have. I did. Tattoo lotion. However, my soon to be brother in law did give me some for Christmas and it was just never and I just never used it. So um <laughs> yeah. Um there is <laughs> somebody moving furniture. What is that? I have anyway. Justin Bieber from Cato also and it smells really good. Um my sister just kinda shit her pants, <laughs> so and this video is too long to remake. Alright, now back to my I'm gonna take you to my closet. Um, <laughs> okay, it's kind of dark, but I have oh my, God. my Hello Kitty. I have Touch of Pink oh my gosh. from Dollar Tree. Yeah. I have <laughs> my Ed Hardy from uh, Dollar Tree. Um, I have Shakira from uh, Kato. Uh, this one is, hang on, let me see. I'll smell it and then I'll just tell you. This one is a Mariah Carey from Dollar Tree. This is Heat by um, Beyonce. Beyonce by um, Kato. Remember a couple months ago I did my impression and I had some of that Beyonce Heat, but it was the generic brand from Zordico. And Mine was the impression of it, and I got that from Dollar This Street. one is um, either Curious or something. I can't remember which one this is by Britney Spears. Isn't that the impression of it? No. Is that the real one? Yeah. Oh, and this one is from Avon. It's called A Touch of Diamond, and it is, it smells so good. And it even got a diamond bracelet on it. Yep, I had a diamond bracelet. Um, did somebody steal it? No. Or, or do you still have I it? I still have it. Oh. Uh, this one is one of my favorites. Nice. It was the Mariah Carey. My f best friend got it for me for Christmas. Um, I have tons. I'll try to... I even collect the bottles, like, when my fiancé yeah, tried throwing this Playboy bunny one away. I kept it. Collection. Here's my other bottle of Lucky. Despite what we just showed you, um... It's normally organized, but... But it, that's... All the, this whole shelf is dedicated to perfume. It may not look that like... That one's a good one, too. And it may not look like a lot right here from where you're seeing it, but you stand in here, and I'm telling you, there there isn't, like, tiny bottles hidden back there. I mean, there's... It's and there's crazy, stuff up but there. it's a really big collection. That's my nail polish, and back there is my Sarah Jessica Parker, my um, Shakira, and my Tattooed. This one is my absolute, absolute yes. favorite. 
It's called Simply Because, and I got it from Avon. It has the best scent in the world. I can't even describe the scent to you, but um, I have Britney Spears back here. I have stuff falling. Harajuku Lover's Love. Sorry, I think that's like the police were calling the alarm. Yeah. She has a lot to do with Harajuku and stuff. I have Tea Rose. That it it's kind of like an old lady smell, but back there? the little bottle. Yeah, yeah, like that tiny box. Yep, How's it's called smell? Fancy. Because I heard that that I heard that was expensive for the little bottle. It is. It's six dollars for this little bottle. Um, this Rio um, Rhythms. It smells good. You too. got that from Avon too. Yep. Okay, so that's enough of my closetness. Hang on, let me back everything now. Do this like a slash uh, perfume slash what's in my closet over here. Yeah. Um, a lot of I'll line everything up. Here was the um, Bath and Body Works hand soap I was going to oh, tell I you about. That. Have you even used it? Nope. I'm waiting for my other stuff to run out. Here's the rest of my collection. I um, collect my... Oh, I collect bottles. <laughs> Perfume bottles. Oh, here's my oh, actual, yeah. actual... That... Uh, Beyonce so, thing yeah. collection. Did you so that this is this the actual Beyonce heat? No. Oh, that's just the impression of it. Yeah. From where? Kato? Yeah, it's it's a pink liquid, but the actual is okay, red. Okay. Now that I've jarred you around. Anyway, that's pretty much. I guess this is a my favorite product slash what's in my closet. However, I will do something like that at my house whenever I'm not busy. And stuff, but anyway, that's so. If you have any tips or or not tips, any or any suggestions on what we should use or like what you think we should try, please let us know. Comment on the box. I'm below. always open for suggestions for perfumes. Trust me, I am. <laughs> now we're still kind of new with these things, but um, well, not really with these things, but this is the desk essentially. So. I'm sorry, I just yeah, noticed so. it. But other than that, that's about it's teeny. That's it smells like oh, it's kind of. It smells awesome, though. That is crazy. I don't really think six dollars is hardly worth it. No, but I had I had the money, so I had it. I forgot to tell you. That was kind of dumb. <laughs> but um, I burped. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, but um, so there's this stuff we got from the I think it was Kato. And I was just I didn't really like it. I think it. <laughs> I mean I'm not. Oh, saying I forgot to show you. I'm it's not dollar. To be it's rude, family dollar. It's called Snappy. It's called Snappy, and I seriously and it really smells like day old dog poop. Dog poop, and I'm just jealous to hear it. And I'm, awesome. I'm not even kidding. It smells horrible. It makes me puke. It smells bad. I think it smells like day old dog poop. Here, smell it now. Yeah, it just smells like dog poop to me. I'm sorry. <laughs> I think it does. I don't like. It's I'm got not, an expensive smell. It just, I don't like it. it All right, makes me puke. Well, thanks for watching. Sorry for the sorry for this video. video being so long. We next time we'll try to. Do Speed up pace. Do the segments or something. But we but we're still trying to do stuff. Thought stuff we so. rambled on, but yep. So um, <laughs> thank you okay. for watching, everybody. Bye. Thank you. Bye.